dragon today we're gonna be cleaning the guinea pigs cage this is actually filming the end of the video first so we're redoing our introduction because the first one got messed up <laughs> <laughs> but if you're new to your ch our channel I'm Brindley I'm Noor this is an educational channel about guinea pigs and beard dragons and also like animal cruelty yeah things like but that. we don't have a beard dragon right now but we do have a beard beard lead bearded, a lead. Beard. A lead and a bearded dragon a lead bearded dragon for us. Okay, whatever. <laughs> for us, but um, yeah, that'll be a whole different videos. Yeah, we'll do a different video on that. So today we're just gonna. It's not. We I do this daily. We're just gonna like clean out the litter, vacuum the the fleece. Oh my god, I can't, I'm forgetting everything. And that it won't take too long. I think this is. Okay, yeah. so without further ado, let's, let's get, get started. Okay, so now we are about to start with cleaning out the dirty litter. Oh. So I'm just going to take out the Heidi's. And yes, so oh. this is a litter that I'm going to use. We just ran out of the old, but this is like cedar and pine. It's safe. So, yeah, this isn't really my favorite brand, but it's good enough. So, yeah. Okay. So, here's my garbage can. And I have a giant spoon. I don't, I have no idea where this came from. It just, I found a giant spoon in my basement and I thought, perfect. You can probably just find something like that off of Amazon. Yeah, something like that. It's <laughs> a giant spoon. So, it's pretty dirty. Here. I'm just gonna clean out the dirty stuff and put it in here. Okay. So now it wasn't that messy today. It was pretty easy. Just cleaned out the wet stuff. Uh oh, I forgot to open this. Hold on one second. I gotta get scissors. We can just cut this part out. about like the hiding places to tell them that yeah, like, where to go and that you need like I get, need, it. Like, I get it 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 okay and, and like blankets actions okay I've got it open and I'm just gonna take like a, the amount that I need to cover this spot I like having like pretty thick bedding because they like to just, like stick their feet in it and relax. And also just because I feel a lot cleaner like that. So now I'm just gonna put this back. Oh, one thing, fun fact, guinea pigs, they're prey animals. Oh my gosh, they're really enjoying it over there. They're prey animals, they need hiding spots. One per guinea pig at least. I have three, cause this, they love to sleep in this, they sleep in here, and I have this that goes here. Oh my god, they're popcorning like crazy. <laughs> okay, so now we're just gonna vacuum. So, so yes. we'll see you when we're done vacuuming. Yes. Okay, so you might be wondering why we're at my <laughs> house, why there's no guinea pig cage, is because we had a whole editing Editing it, don't ask, just. I mean, it just happened that we were editing the video. Bingo. And then why we realized we didn't record the second part of it. Yeah. So, so we're just moving on and gonna explain everything to what you. What I did was I vacuumed the fleece with my handheld vacuum because I think we weren't even recording that part when I actually explained it in my house. So it's a week later now and we're talking about it. Like it was 
a few seconds ago. Yeah. So handheld vacuums, they're fun, easy, not fun, but they're easier. <laughs> you can use your normal vacuum, just like get the two part of it. That's what I do. Yeah, she just like she gets the tube to get it, and then she can actually vacuum my um, your drug tank. <sighs> stress. Okay, so editing go stress. On. Okay, so go on. <laughs> okay, so yeah, I just vacuumed the fleece and I vacuumed under it. it. It's that vacuuming part is pretty simple. And also, what I did was I let the guinea pigs go, and I gave them food, and I refilled their hay, and I gave them kibble. No, I didn't actually give them kibble, did I? No, you didn't give them No, because I already had given them that in the morning. So I gave them hay, I let them out, and I fed them dinner. Yes. Sorry for the inconvenience. Yes. Like we said. I'm sorry. Coming up. What we're saying, coming up. Comment if you have any questions about that. So, coming up, we'll say we'll have an updated version because this is so untacky of us. Untacky. untacky. I'm going to make that a word. Untacky. We'll add it to the dictionary. <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> sorry for the inconvenience. Yeah. But, bye. Bye. Okay, well, today you learned how we clean the guinea pig's cage, or I clean the guinea pig's cage. And probably in the future, there will be an updated one. Cause yes. We're, I'm planning on expanding their cage a lot more. We're probably going to move in the next months. I don't know. And then we'll have bigger rooms with bigger. They're happily eating their food right now. Yeah. I don't know. Okay, so thank you guys for watching. See you next time. Bye. Bye.